that was scary. It was extremely scary. Very well burned into my memory. Using the panic button helped save a student's life. When we were walking away from the scene after the, the teacher had been transported, uh, the school nurse, we were walking back to her office, she said, my God, that was easy. People would say, I didn't know, I don't I call 911, how do I know when to call 911, how do I know if it's really necessary or not? It takes that, think, that heaviness, that worry, that uncertainty off of those people who just aren't trained to know in those situations. Our phones went off and I could immediately look on my phone and tell that the uh, panic button had been placed for Benton High School and I knew that it was at the uh, baseball field. We were quickly able to get over there and help and I think that's one of the big benefits of the panic button is that you get emergency responders very, very quickly, which I think helps save this child's life. It was able to bring in more healthcare professionals, our school nurse. It was able to alert administrators so that they could help um, run the scene, get people out of the scene that should not be there. Um, it, it alerted them to our location, which was, I feel like that was very beneficial. Even though we have the, the capacity to communicate with one another, instant multiple communication ability doesn't exist without the panic button. We're able to get a help out there a lot quicker to these folks than, uh, than we were able to before and, you know, uh, maybe three to five minutes faster. What kind of price could you put on a life? Uh, I think if you ask his mom and dad, there is no price. There is no price. Not as with us either. Uh, that child's life was saved because we were able to respond as quickly as we did.